Hey, what is up guys? Matt here from the Toasty Rails and I'm here with another video. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about the new PC we're gonna be building. It's a $400 gaming PC and gaming server hosting PC that we're gonna be using for our 24 hour live stream. Special thanks to AMD for sending over hardware for this build, featuring an AMD FX 6350. And without further ado, let's roll that intro. Now, as I said, most of this build was supported by AMD. Thanks to them for sending over this hardware. Really appreciate it. They're awesome, and they are a main supporter of the actual 24-hour live event. If you haven't seen the announcement video for that, be sure to click the I right up here, and it will take you to that video. The live stream was on June 24, 2016, if you're watching this in the future. So if you want to watch the archive, it's on YouTube, so you can definitely check that out. So without further ado, let's get into the parts of this build. As for the CPU, as I mentioned, this is the AMD FX 6350 featuring a Wraith cooler. Really awesome little CPU. It's good for gaming, six cores. It will do awesome for just hosting game servers is what we're mainly gonna be using it for and that sort of thing. So when we're doing live LAN events and we're doing games with our fans, we have a game server hoster right here instead of having to play it all on LAN. So that's an awesome thing to have. And a 6350 has enough cores to be able to handle some gaming and server hosting. So, you know, it's a great option, especially with the Wraith cooler. It's gonna look really, really cool. So then for the motherboard to house this CPU, we have the MSI 970A G43 Plus motherboard. It's an all black motherboard, looks really clean. Um, it's ATX, full size motherboard, and it really has all the bells and whistles we need to, ho to house the AMD FX6350 and the graphics card, which is not the R9 390, which is what this box says, but the R9 270X. This graphics card is gonna do great for the build. The R9 390 is in my PC because as my PC being the main streaming PC, I felt the need to have more horsepower behind it. So I took my old 270X, put it in this box and basically said, hey, we're gonna put the 270X with the 6350 and it's gonna look a baller. So yeah. Thanks to AMD for sending over this stuff right here. They sent over the processor, graphics card, and the 970A motherboard. So special thanks to them. And the rest of the stuff is what we picked up. So I decided to pick up for RAM-wise. We went with the G-Skill Ripjaws G-Series. Awesome, awesome RAM. Uh, red color scheme, 600 megahertz. I have 16 gigs of that in my system. Really awesome RAM, really reliable. Haven't had any issues with it. And G-Skill is a very awesome brand. And as for the power supply, we went with the legendary EVGA 430 watt. It's really not even that legendary, but it's just an awesome power supply. Uh, very reliable for what we've done. We've used this in a lot of builds. If you haven't watched our builds before, it's a really awesome, very budget oriented, $25 around that price range with rebates and that sort of stuff. So it's very, very budget oriented. 430 watts should be plenty for this build. Cable management is not the best because it's not fully modular and that sort of stuff, but we don't expect it at 25 freaking dollars. Uh, but it's an awesome power supply. It's really quiet. It does a really good job for actually putting out power and powering the system. So we highly recommend this power supply for the build and it's gonna do awesome for us. And then last but certainly not least, we have the good old hard drive, which is the Western Digital Caviar Blue uh, one terabyte hard drive. It's in here. I'm not gonna make too much noise trying to take it out, but yep, that's where that is. And then let's see what else is that everything. Oh, and the case is gonna be my Cooler Master um, Half 912. It's an older case I had before I upgraded to the Be Quiet uh, Silent Base 600. Trying to get that out of my mouth. Uh, we're gonna do some mods to it because I know I did a color scheme on it and it looks pretty cool. But we're gonna add some logos and that sort of stuff and make it look like the official official PC of the 24 hour extra life live stream. So it's gonna be pretty cool to add those customizations to it. So, you know, without further ado, let's just get into building this thing. This is a Chucky Beat production.
Alright guys, so this concludes the build. Um, I really like this PC. It was pretty easy to put together, no real issues at all, no kind of difficulties, so it was pretty awesome. One thing I am going to have to do, because I had to ghetto rig the hard drive to fit in there, because I had no hard drive sliders to fit into the hard drive bay, I had to kind of ghetto rig my hard drive into the, into the case over here, my Cooler Master Half 912. But basically, whenever we do other things with this build, I'm probably gonna pick up another case anyway. So this is just temporary and for the live stream. So really not that big of a deal, but the system performs very well. If you wanna see full gaming benchmarks of this bad boy back here, be sure to tune in to the Extra Life 24 hour live stream where we're gonna be doing benchmarks and basically playing the game. So Jackson's just gonna be using it as his game machine and that's how we're gonna tell how well it works. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, leave a like. If you like this video, leave a dislike. If you dislike this video and comment down below, what you all like the most and what you think I should improve and I hope you guys have a wonderful day and be sure to use all our affiliate links down in the description below whenever you shop on Amazon or G2A or anywhere under the sun and I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Peace out.